Hello and welcome to Curse of the Dead Gods. Um, I'm going to go back to a stable. I'm going to go back to... Hmm. Hmm. I w was going to say that I was going to go back to a stable. But none of these look like fun stables. None of those look like fun stables at all. Not one bit. All right, what do we got going on here? I think I go attribute relic, and then depending on the relic, I either go for another relic, or I try and go for the champ for the first champion. All right, we're in Fiery Hall, so that means that we're going to be going against the Fire Boss, which he's annoying. He's definitely annoying. We haven't beat him yet, but... We are getting better. Plus 15% damage to lightning attacks. We'll take it for now in case we start specking into... Um, lightning damage, but I don't, I honestly don't see us specking into lightning damage. Um, we'll spend the gold for both favors. And I chose the wrong option. Oh my god. I just hit X on, ah, oh, gee, I didn't. Well, this, this is already turning out into a fantastic run. And we got poisoned by the simplest thing. God. This is just freaking fantastic, isn't it? Mistiming parries. Everything is going so flipping great. Jeez. Terrible room. Absolutely terrible, horrendous room. Okay. So, we're getting a new weapon. Um... I don't want those. I don't want any of those. That would be nice, but we're we're on the uh, the fire boss, so it's gonna be useless. Those are all useless. Um, poison attacks. Poison attacks might be in our favor. Poison attacks might be in our favor. It is a weaker pistol, though. Last reroll. I'm gonna offer the blood for the storm lash, and I think we have a relic that dropped. That is, yeah, plus fifteen percent. Okay, so. We did end up specking into lightning damage, interestingly enough. Okay. Spawn additional creatures when killed. That's that's fine with me. That's fine with me. So we're sword and whip. We're Indiana Jones, basically. We're Dr. Jonesing it. Of course. I guess Dr. Jonesing it would more likely be um, if we had a gun and a whip. Jeez. 
Jeez, that was... Doing some bad times right now. Doing some real bad times. Um, none of these that look really good. None of these look real good at all. Um, maybe that one? Maybe... Yeah, you know what? We'll get a different sword. We'll get a different sword. Finishers costing no stamina is really good. It's actually a... I like that perk on a weapon. So let's go. And depending on how badly I do against this first champion here, um, I might want to instead go towards the weapon upgrade. As my dog begs me to feed her an hour before her usual bet or bre or dinner time. It's, it's later in the evening. Should have parried. You know, I just realized that if I parry his Jaguars, that I can, because of the blessings that I have, I can transfer the weakened state onto him, and that's the main way that I'm going to be able to get him into a weakened state. That's the way to do it. Gains obtained when offering a gear object to the gods are increased by 100%. I'll take that. To remove a curse, I don't need that. Finishers throw the spear, piercing through all enemies, plus 20% damage per active curse, plus 50% damage taken. Go big or go home. We got a trophy for that? Equip a hidden champion weapon. Cool. Um, I don't want that. So we're going to offer that for the extra perception. I think we're gonna go here. We're gonna get it another curse, but we're gonna go against the champion. I do kind of want to try out that spear and see how it works because I'm just I'm curious. It's probably not gonna be worth using long term. And I um, immediately set myself on fire. Gold offerings remove five corruption. Never gonna... Yeah, that's... Maybe... If it was like... Per gold you remove so much corruption... Or like, gold offerings remove 5% corruption... Or gold offerings remove like... 5 or 10% of the... Um, offering amount in corruption... That might be something. That was cool. What was that? I think I need to use the spear. I think I need to be using this spear. Um, let's try out Yatsa's gift.
and no, because I really want that weapon upgrade. I really want that weapon upgrade. Lose as much gold as you take damage. Health loss is reduced by 25%. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're taking 50% more damage, so now we're taking 25% less damage. I don't think that's going to quite equate down to how I think. can't believe that. Come on. Come on. Uh, uh, what the fuck? Oh my god. I'm just going to try and parry this. It's not working. It's not working out for me. Okay. That last one. I need to dodge away from him. And then I need to worry about... Oh, I'm so close to that. I feel it. Oh, I'm just so... I'm, I'm frustrated. I'm... I'm getting frustrated at it. I'm getting super frustrated at it. I can't believe I defeated that boss. I thought I was going to die. All right. What do we got? For spears? Sure. We got a spear, technically. Um, 39 health. This next room is going to kill me. This next room is straight just going to kill me. So, F it. We're just going to use Spear. The Spear is my most powerful weapon. <laughs> I got killed by the spikes! Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. <laughs> If you didn't click that like button, and if you're not already, please consider subscribing to the channel. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you next time.